Y'all, before I say anything else, uh, mind the mess in the back that you might see, because I just got back from Florida and I forgot that I left my depression room. Like, I didn't clean it because I was still stuck in, like, my depression here. But then I went to Disney World and I was, like, happy. So now I'm, like, motivated to do things. But I don't have time to do this right now because I have to go to school in, like, 10 minutes. But anyway, here's a haul of all the stuff I got at Disney World if you care. Maybe you do care. I mean, you clicked on the video. Okay, so the first thing is this henna. So it's not really like a haul, but I did pay for it. I think this is so cute. It means guidance. I love henna so much. There, I, I I keep telling them I want to get this tattooed, so bad. I'm obsessed with it. Okay, next. This is kind of funny. So I, uh, some people say Ghirardelli, some people say Ghirardelli. I don't really know which one it is, but we went here because I don't know. I just really wanted chocolate so bad. I was just like in the mood for it. I guess. But um, this is like the small gift that is $15 and it says you can fit approximately 25 chocolates in here. And I ate four already. So let's see how many are in there because I shoved them in so I could. So I already ate four. Thirty-three chocolates in a in a twenty-five count one because I wanted to get the most for my money, and plus I love these chocolates so much. This one, these two are my favorites. This one is um white sugar cookie. First time I ever tried it, very good. And then the caramel, love. Okay, so Pirates of the Caribbean is like a classic. Like it's one of my favorite rides, and I love sweatpants. So I had to get Pirates of the Caribbean sweatpants. They're like this gray and white kind of tie dye. And they kind of are just like form fitting and stretchy. They aren't um, drawstring, which I like. I don't like drawstring that much. So I hope they fit. I got a small and an extra small. But look, I'm obsessed with these. And all it goes down one leg, and the other leg is plain. I think that they're really cute, and I'm happy with this purchase. The thing is, I got this Save the Bees hat, Winnie the Pooh, and it's like a, just like olive green corduroy. First of all, Save the Bees. Of course, Save the Bees. Second of all, Winnie the Pooh, and then Corduroy, and Olive Green. This is, like, every single thing I love, like, in a hat. And it actually looks good. I don't want to mess up my hair, but, like, because I have a claw clip in the back. But it looks good. I love it. I usually don't look good in hats. I look good in this hat, and I love this hat. Um, This is for my boyfriend, so you're not going to look at it. Because he's, I don't know if he's watching this, but if he is watching it, you don't get to see it. And this was such a splurge. Literally, we were leaving. We, like, we went to Disney Springs, and then we were going on the Magical Express to leave. And I was like, okay, we're not going to buy anything. And then I bought this, because I was obsessed with it. Look at this! This is from Uniqlo. Like, come on. It's like French Mickey painting. I took three years and two days of French. Because I was supposed to take it for my fourth year, my senior year. But two days in, I was like, I don't want to do this anymore. This is really hard. And so, and not proud of it, but I quit. Because I was just like, I was like, you know what? I don't want to be stressed out. This is hard. And plus, we got a new teacher. And she is very nice. But I was like, too much. Too much for me. Yeah. I love Starbucks. I'm not going to lie. I am one of those people. I love Starbucks. But I don't get it all the time. Because it is expensive. And I'm not like, I don't waste my money on it that much. But... Yeah, I had to get the 50th because it's the 50th Disney. So it's like a souvenir for that. And it's a cute Starbucks cup. I'm obsessed with cups. I buy cups anywhere and everywhere I go. I love cups. I don't know why. I don't even have a house. But look at this. So it's like the Starbucks cup. And it's like Hollywood Studios thing because I really love this part. Take out the trash can and this dinosaur guy. And then from Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Look at this. Toy Story. And the bird from the Mickey and Minnie ride? Like, come on. Come on. This is, it's so cute. And it's like, it's not too heavy, but it's not too, like, flimsy where it's, like, cheap, you know? It's like, it's good. And I didn't, there's no cracks. I made sure I looked at it before. She's cute. Next, 
I got these for my sister, uh, my neighbor, Totoro. Honestly, I'm not going to lie. I don't like to be a poser, but I don't watch this anime, personally. So I know nothing about them. I just FaceTimed her, and there's, like, five chopsticks to choose from, and she thought these were the cutest. Because they have, like, little umbrellas on them. I've definitely seen this before, but I don't, like, watch it. But those are for my sister. She really liked these. But I did get Ponyo ones, and I, Ponyo was my favorite. One of my favorite movies, like, top five. Obsessed with it. Ponyo wants ham. I think these are so cute. I feel like they're going to break easily, though. I hope they don't. I was in the store right under Teppanito in Japan, by the way. And I also got this at the store. It's just, it's so cute. And I have these little, like, postcards of art. I have them. Like, there's one there and one there. And I have, I'm going to buy a couple more next time I go back to Disney. And I'm just going to, like, fill that little wall with these because I think they're so cute. Like, I don't want to commit to, like, a big art piece because then it's, like, oh, like, Disney in your face. But this is, like, a little, not this one, personally, because it's not too Disney. It's not Disney at all, actually. It could be. Yeah, that's the front whatever my point is it's like a subtle little touch of disney to a point where like it's cute and it's not like disney in your face that's how i like it. that's how i like it personally then i got this keychain from my friend caitlin or tiny look at it it's like cute little fromage ready and then they pop out literally the most overpriced keychain i've ever bought in my life but it's hilarious it is worth it it's so hard to push though because I just woke up and I'm tired. But look, so cute, love. I got a bunch of pressed pennies. These are all from the same place. These are all from the Polynesian. So this one is like from Trader Sam's. And last cup, but my mom has it and I don't know where it is. I, like, I have no idea where it is and I don't want to like dig through her stuff. So pretend I showed you one more cup. Oh, gee, it's such a cute cup. Yeah, but that's the end of this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, comment below what you thought, and subscribe. Remember that you are loved and appreciated. Reach out to me or anybody else if you need help. Like, I've been saying, like, that little part for so long, but I should just add on to it. Because, like, if you need help, talk to somebody. Like, even if it's hard, like, talk to your friends, talk to your parents if you can. Talk to your grandma, talk to your aunt, uncle, cousin. Talk to a counselor, talk to a therapist. Like, talk to somebody. And also, um... I'm not sure if I'm posting this first or the vlogs first, but either way, check out my Disney vlogs. I put a lot of effort into them. It took me three days. Like, okay, I'm done. Bye.